Hi everyone, welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the crew. Today we have a new Dollar Tree video for you guys. I'm sorry it's going out a day late. I hope you saw my community tab post. I was ill this week and I didn't want to go out and spread my germs. So this video is for January 7th, 2023. Thank you for being patient with me. Let's go shopping. We're going to start in apparel and accessories first. There's a lot new this week in the store. We've got these large tote bags. I showed a few of them last week, like the one with the bike here but there were a few that I um, missed and so I wanted to make sure you guys saw all the bags that they have out. These are the reusable bags that are easy to clean and wipe off. They've got that plastic feel on the outside. They also have the one with the truck for spring. They started to put out the ones with the stripes and all the different fruit and things for like summer and springtime. They also had some new eye masks for sleeping. I love this one so much. It's got this white faux fur on the outside. It's really pretty. And then they have a few that have a coordinating scrunchie with it. And I just found a few different ones of those. There's like a pink one. And then there's like this marbled blue one that I found. Now for the arts and crafts, some new items over there this week. Some real exciting things that I found. I was pretty happy to find these gemstone stickers. There's a hundred pieces. We saw these about a year ago. They've got the ombre look. It kind of goes from the white silver look down to the um, like light gray and then into black or it's got like the really light ballerina pink into the darker pink. It also fades in from the light red to the dark red. Really pretty. And then of course they also have the blue set here. They had a bunch of the stickers that are those decorative stickers you could put on glass. You can use them for um, vases, mirrors, uh, water bottles, coffee cups, a whole bunch of different options. They've got um, one for Father's Day out. Out. Um, they also have the Mother's Day one. They have a few different ones with like inspirational sayings. And there's like five to six stickers per pack. It really depends on which package you purchase and how large the stickers are. But I'm pretty sure most of them have at least five stickers in them. There's also some new vinyl out. We've seen the white and black buffalo plaid before, but not the white and red. They've had the red with the black, but I was excited to see the white. That will look really good for Valentine's Day. Then look at these wood bead wreaths they have out. There are three different ones. They're about 10 inches around. Really nice. These would be a few dollars uh, at you know, any other craft store. So just a dollar twenty-five here. They've also got these felt flowers with the leaves. You could get the purple and yellow or the pink and blue flowers. It comes with the leaves and the glue. And then I hadn't seen the colorful flowers before, but we have seen these white roses. They've had these out before and sometimes they'll sell pink roses as well. They've got the felt boho craft kit with the wire wreath form. We saw these about two weeks ago and I'm finding these at more stores this week. They've got the crafter square paint strainers. These are really cool. Um, item that I found this week. At first I thought they were for the kitchen and then when I looked closer I realized they were for those paint pouring crafts that you can do. There's a bunch of different designs and patterns in these strainers and they're hanging on one of those little plastic strips down the craft aisle. So that was exciting. They also had the wood squares that you could use for the paint pour craft. There's some new um stencils out. They've got the alphabet. They have this one that says embrace the rhythm of the season. Any pizza is a personal pizza if you believe in yourself. They have this one. It says shine bright. We also have dream big. Be a rainbow in someone else's cloud. Trust yourself. There is the happy birthday, fun party, surprise. Coffee is my spirit animal. I just love this one. It says be kind with the giant bee. And then the Believe with the butterflies and hearts. And my personal favorite, the watering can with the flowers. So cute. There's also the gnome. It says gnome, sweet gnome. Love this one. And like last week, we saw these new mandala uh, style flexible stencils. And those are on the purple cards. They have some paisleys and a few different um, mandalas. There's also these new wood palette signs. They're the vertical signs. Ari has the um, hanger at the top. You can get them in white, black, and brown. Then they brought back the glass pens. 
but you can dip in the ink. Really fun. They usually put these out around Christmas time. They have them in pink, green, and blue. And then they had the Crazy Loom Rainbow Blast uh, rubber band loom that you can make bracelets and things with. And you can get those in a few different colors. There's the Neon Glow, the Rainbow Blast, and Candy Craze. So each color loom has a different theme. There's also some new items in the baby aisle. They've restocked the, um, it's kind of like a pacifier, but it has little holes in it to eat fruit and things like that to introduce fruits to little ones. It's got the lids. So you can close it up if they don't eat it all. They also had some new snack containers and the no spill um, style container that rocks, but it doesn't really tip over. And it's got that plastic insert to keep uh, the little ones from spilling it. So they've got the um, giraffe, we've got the elephant, and they have have the dinosaur and the plastic matches the lids like the yellow one has the yellow plastic pole over in health and beauty we're going to start with the new cosmetics this week they have some new la colors lip gloss this is the glossy finish and the clear they also had this one it's called fruit punch it's the moisturizing lip gloss And then there is Happiness. It's like a really light pink. Has a little touch of glitter in it. It really looks like a nude type lip gloss. They have Coral Crush. It has a tiny hint of a peachy orange kind of color. And these are all enriched with vitamin E. They also have Paradise Pink. It was a bright pink. And then Cheerful. This one also has a little bit of glitter in it. So it's a little bit um, sparkly there. And then there's the dreamy pink. And that has a bit of glitter in it as well. They also had some new beauty blenders in these plastic containers. So you could store them. There is the blue and purple with the glitter lid. Or you could get the two pack of the latex free blender sponges. They had them in yellow red kind of like a reddish orange and they had like an off-white they also had some new sashi chic blush brush eyeshadow brush and foundation brushes these are really cute they've got like a confetti in the handle over in the hair care items this week we've got these clock clips that kind of have like a um like paint splatter on it i guess they've got the white a pink this is a really light blue that you can kind of see through the plastic it's got like an opalescent type finish on it so it's got that really pretty shine they also have a tan and then you can get the natural colors this one's like a brown and black mixture or you could get the solid black matte claw clip there's also this new uh, ladies choice hairspray and mousse and those are in the full size bottles the pharmacy and personal care items this week. We've got these Bolero whipped body butters. So there's four different scents here. We've got the fresh watermelon and aloe, cactus pear and avocado. And then there is the tropical hibiscus and rose and cool mint eucalyptus. Those are four ounces. Then they have the body wash in the same scents. And the uh, body wash, I believe are eight ounce bottles. Then I found these mason jar um, hand soaps. These are so pretty. There's 13 fluid ounces. We've got the spiced apple, vanilla cookies, and pumpkin spice. And I just love these jars. You could reuse these once they were empty. You can even change the labels if you want. For fun finds this week, we've got a couple of new items. They have their string lights and the pink glitter. They look like almost like a Christmas ornament. They sell these every year. You get six in a pack. You do need to put batteries in them. The small novelty lights, which are the flamingo and the pineapple. We saw these last week, but I found these at a few more stores. If you haven't seen them yet, they have a button cell batteries like in the bottom there. Make sure the door is on. I found a few that were missing the door, but you just pull out the tab and it's got the on off switch on the bottom. Over in home decor, there are a few new items, real exciting new finds. We've got these um, tea light candle holders that look like a sunflower. They've got like a marigold yellow. They also have a sage greeny gray color 
kind of like a mix between the two colors and then white and these are all in a matte finish and here is a view from the side for you guys you can get a good view of them there's these new votives that have um, all of them have like a tropical jungle style pattern on the glass on the outside and then one of them has like some tropical leaves mixed in with some animal print we've got a bunch of new farmhouse items these are the exciting new items I found this week I love this beaded tassel here we've got the natural white black and buffalo plaid beads they're wooden about a medium sized bead with the um tassel there we've got some new signs that say life is better on the farm it's got the galvanized metal word that says life we've got farm fresh moo with the cow moo is the galvanized metal accent there's also the pig that says farm fresh oink and it's got the metal on it as well now these little wood cutouts that say love home gather and family they are like a craft kit i guess you can make your own signs you can paint them they're real thin wood almost like that balsa wood that you could cut up really cute so i would love to see what people craft with these um there's some tabletop signs with some galvanized metal accents like blessed with love and laughter there's love keeps us together and friends are life's greatest blessings there's also these little signs here there's four all together we have seen these before they've got a wood um, kind of accent with the galvanized metal background and then the farmhouse signs that say love in home with the windmill as the o really cute for $1.25. One of my favorite finds this week were these little chickens. I don't know why they make me laugh, but I think they're so cute. So they've got the black and white chickens. They're like a large egg and they're about five inches tall. They've also got the pictures back in and the orange, blue, and pink. And then the love sign and the home sign with the wreath for the O. Oh, those are also in that farmhouse section. They've got the... um wire words on this little stand they've got gold black and silver they say blessed there's hello and then the silver one here says hope i also found these farmhouse signs it's a little metal duck that says farm fresh produce there's good food is good mood that's the cow and then the pig says life is better on the farm they brought the shadow box style piggy banks um, we've got loading and then little man cave it's got a bunch of little pictures on the background there we've got good vibes with the pineapple and butterfly and yes girl with the um, kind of like bandala patterns in the background over in the office supplies home library and teaching tree last week we saw they had these new square shaped wired net for the office we've got these square shaped wire baskets they're all in like a rose gold or copper color with the hang it's actually quite nice for just a dollar 25 the baskets are a little small but they're not bad this is a shelf here that you can hang on it and then they've also got all of the connectors you can connect them all together and make a larger wall unit and then i found this rectangular basket this week um, that was new so i wanted to show you guys all the pieces i'm finding they also had these new jot brand spring clips you get two for the larger three for the medium and five for the small and the small really isn't all that small they're quite large there's also these eight count paper clips we've got the gold shaped paper clip with the star they also have a heart shape and then the like oval there with the heart in the background we've got these new pencil cups with this pink and gold marble look which was so cute um we've seen these in the buffalo plaid now they have the marble out which is just adorable they also have the pen and pencil holder to go along with the buffalo plaid ones that stand up they have the pencil cups that match those or you could just get the solid colors in the light gray and lilac purple i believe there is pink also but they were gone already they brought back these pencil cups with the confetti um like styrofoam balls those are all in the four pastel colors purple pink blue and green they've got the jot markers with the eraser that's the dry erase markers then i found these large um journals it says pour your heart out a journal with a bit of wisdom and a touch of charm these are huge. I bet it has every bit of 150 to 200 pages. And they were like $20 by the price tag on the back, but they're just $1.25. There's also some more Nancy Drew books and more of the Hardy Boys with different um, series that we've seen before. There's also the Image Ink books. They've got Coco Melon. These are the um, 
little markers that you color over the pages and then the pictures show up. They have the LOL dolls. There's also Paw Patrol and Spider-Man. And those are all the Imagine Ink books. Now for the housewares, home maintenance, electronics, and automotive. We've got these new, um, it's like a cup organizer. It's got these extra bins that you can extend your um, cup holder. And then they had these things called car hooks. They've got these little hooks that you could put up. And I think it's to hang different like bags and purses and things like that. They've got decorations on the sides. You've got your heart. You can also get the stars. There are the rainbows, and it's either a lemon or an orange. I'm not sure which one, but you get two in each pack. They had some new storage bins. These are over by the office supplies. They've got pink. Also, there's the green. They have bright orange and blue. And then they have the smaller bins here as well. And these have the snap-on lids. And then we've got these larger bins. Um, these are stackable as well. They have this little cutout in the front, so it kind of dips down to like a little, almost like a handle to help you pull it out of a cubby. They've got the um, trays in a few different colors. And then there's also the file in book holders in several different colors. We've got some new collapsible bins. These are the two-tone. They're 10 by 10 by 11. So this is like a... Um, sage green blue color um, with a tan at the top they have the light pink like a rose color and then you could also get it in the gray and tan or beige and those are all the 10 by 10 by 11 size bins you could also get the closet essentials um, this one is the pink with the um, white kind of crisscross pattern here you can get the green and the gray we have a lot of items coming out right now in these three color schemes. And that's the gray one, just a close up so you guys could see the pattern really well. Over in the kitchen and pantry, we've got these new um, bowl covers. They are the reusable bowl covers. It's like a large silicone. You get two in each pack, and those are hanging on the plastic strips. I found them in the aisle with like um, sandwich bags, saran wrap. And things like that. They also have some new bamboo um, cooking utensils with a rubberized handle at the top to help you hold on to them. I thought that was really nice. All of the rubber at the top is in gray. And you've got a bunch of different spatulas, slotted spoons, and things like that. We have some new ceramic uh, magnets for the kitchen. It's a be grateful, bless this home, and not today, Satan. We've also got the Santitas mild salsa and the hot, and those are the full size jars for just $1.25. Over in the pet care this week, a few new items. We've got the um, dog collar accessories and scarves. So cute. So they're in this little cardboard box at the end of the aisle. We've got some collar flowers. They have purple flower here, they've got some pink roses, and then the pink, the darker pink flower. And those will all fit on a collar. We've also got the ties. I just think these are so cute. So they've got the white one, a velvet red tie, the white and blue. And those are the regular neckties. And then you can get bow ties also. We've got a cheetah pattern, a Christmas kind of pattern. They've got the orange, blue, and white plaid. And then they also have a fleece scarf. really cute. Now for the seasonal items, there's a lot of different items out for the season. We'll start with Valentine's. They brought back these bags. These are the fabric bags. The smaller ones, you get three and there's two different patterns. You could either get the large heart or the bunch of like tiny little hearts. The tiny hearts were all in pink. They've got a pink drawstring. So those are the three count. The smaller bags, you can get the three count of the large red heart on the outside. You could also get the um, larger bags. You get two, and those either have the red or the pink hearts on the front. Those are a repeat. We've got the candle holders that are heart-shaped in pink, red, and white. Love these so much. 
They also have their heart doilies in a bunch of different sizes. I only saw them in red so far, but they usually do carry them in white and pink as well. We've got some new cookie cutters that say, I love you, and they are metal. We've got the baker's twine. You get three pieces in that packet there. They have their cupcake or little snack paper cups with the hearts on the outside. And then they have these silicone um, little dishes here. So you've got the hearts that do six large or you've got the heart shape that does the little ones. And those come in red and in pink for both of those. They also have the cupcake pans or muffin pans that are heart shaped and the heart shaped measuring cups. Those come in red and in pink. And then they had some new towels. These are um, so cute. They've got, I'm only way to steal your heart or on the way to steal your heart. Um, will you be my Valentine with the bike? And then um, no, there's nobody like you with the gnomes. We've got the bike that says be mine in the pink. It's got the pot holders to match. They had oven mitts as well. And then they also have the new terry cloth gnomes. Um, the towel they have in oven mitt and hot pad holders to match this. You can also get the solid red in the oven mitt, the hot pad holders. They have soup bowls. Now, some of them have the white inside and the red on the outside, and others are the solid red in the inside and the outside. So it just depends um, what you prefer. They've got the red glass plates and then the rectangle platter. I love these bowls. You can find these at like Hobby Lobby for a few dollars or just $1.25 for the exact same size at the Dollar Tree. They say XOXO. And then we've also got this one with all the different hearts on it in red and black. And these are cardboard, but they're a large, almost like a popcorn bowl, if you think of that, like from the movie theater um, for like different snacks and things for parties. We've got the wine tumblers that are plastic. I'd say XOXO Love, Be My Valentine, the Be Mine with the heart in the middle. And then there's also some coffee cups with the um, lids. We've got the large plastic bowls with the snap-on lids. There's two different patterns there. The large serving bowl that's heart-shaped. And then the bins that say love you always with the handles on the side in red. Hearts and hugs in pink. I found these at a few more stores this week. So I want to make sure you guys knew that I'm finding these popping up more and more. They've also got these two bins here. I found some more gnomes. These are the $1.25 gnomes. They're about 10 inches tall. They come in different skin tones. And then we've got the girls and the boys. There's quite a few different varieties. They have like different hats and different clothes. So cute. There's these little stuffed um, treats. We've got the cupcake, the donut. And then this heart-shaped chocolate. There are some DIY items. These were out last year. It says, I'm rooting for you, looking sharp, and I'm a sucker for you, that you can paint the beaded heart wreath. Just $1.25. They got the heart palette sign. There's the DIY solid wood heart. We've seen these before. They had them out last year. The wood palette hearts that are already painted in pink, red, and white. There's the flower DIY holders that are like a diamond shape. They've got the gnome, the red truck with the heart, and be mine with the bumblebee. These were out last year. The DIY wood truck with the heart in the back, about the same size as the one we see around Christmas time. They have the I love you more. This is a vertical DIY heart sign. These are held together with a wire kind of like um, tie. There's also the red, white, and pink vertical signs that look like a house. Happy Valentine's Day wood palette sign. The chalkboard with the red glitter around the outside. We've seen this before. There's the pink heart that says be mine in the red glitter. The red heart with the word love in a bunch of different font all the way around. There's also the love sign with the plaid. And then the key that says you hold the key to my heart. 
we saw that last year. These signs have like a faux gold uh, on the outside there. They got the pink one, the blue one that says be mine and happy Valentine's Day. There's also the truck that says happy Valentine's Day, loads of love. It's got a faux metal ribbon with um, the hearts cut out on the side. We've got the mason jars. These are a large sign. They come in pink and in white with different sayings on them. The tags, love is all you need, has the red and white beaded hanger. And then the buffalo plaid pink and white that says love. It has a white, pink, and red beaded hanger. These vertical signs, we've got love um, with the flowers written on the, you know, kind of like added to the font there for that vertical sign. Love is a journey with the bike. And then the love with the glitter and burlap. And then the last one says welcome. And it's a gnome that has a cheetah print hat on. We've got the love is all you need, darling. And it has the beaded hanger as well. Hugs, kisses, Valentine wishes, darling, also has the beaded hanger. Um, kissing booth, 25 cents per kiss. We saw the sign last year as well as these kissing booth signs with the open and close sign that flips over. Really cute. They come in two different colors. For St. Patrick's Day, we've got a few items out. They also have a beaded uh, garland in the dark green, light green, and white. That's got the twine tassel on the end. We have a bunch of vertical signs. It's a lucky Irish. There's a few others, but my pictures didn't turn out real well. So I'm going to try to get those better for next week. We have a galvanized metal shamrock with an initial in the middle. And the little tag there shows you all the different letters that they come in. There's also the repeat welcome sign here. We saw this last year. They've also got the shamrock wreath that says welcome. Um, and those are all like those um, MDF board. We've got the shamrocks that look like um, faux palette wood. Some of them are the um, glitter shamrocks. We've seen these year after year. I'm uh, not really a whole lot new when it comes to the St. Patrick's Day items. They do have these foam shamrocks wearing a top hat. They come in a couple different shades of green and then the um, horizontal welcome sign. They also have some ribbon, which I love with the gnomes on it. I thought that was so cute. And then this one says um, St. Patrick's Day. It has like rainbows and shamrocks on it. As you turn it, this is the wired ribbon. They've got the orange, green, and white stripes. You've got the green glitter. And then the burlap that says lucky or the dark green. They have the pool noodles in orange, white, and green also. And then for Easter, there's a few items out. Um, they are going to put more out soon. They've got the gift bags, a couple of them. Um, it's got like a plaid or the bunny background. I've seen these at two stores this week. They have a whole bunch of boxes labeled Easter that are just waiting to be opened and stocked. And they're pastel color like flowers and branches and the uh, beaded or the uh, little berries there. Also these um, droopy type flowers they have stocked and the spring color pull noodles. They've got the carrot wreath form and then their potted plants with the spring flowers. So I'm sure we'll see more of the Easter items soon. They also have some new spring and garden items. They've got the garden flags out. These are the 12 by 18 inch flags. This one says home sweet home. We've got like a bunch of flowers around it. Our farmhouse with the weather vane. This one says um, bloom and grow. Also the welcome with the bike and flowers. You've got Welcome Gnome with the gnome in the garden with a watering can and beehive hat. Blessed with the bird um, house here. They have some new um, wind chime crafts that you can make. It's got a plastic piece you can attach to it. They had like a ladybug, a butterfly, or like a dragonfly. They have some new um, canvas boards with the paint. You get four um, paint colors, a paintbrush, the easel, and the canvas board with the picture printed on the front. They have one with a gnome on it and the mushroom house. 
all new. There are these garden tags that look like a chalkboard. We've got a flower. The back is just solid wood. We've also got the watering can. They have these birds. There are butterflies. And then the, um, I believe these are bumblebees and ladybugs. I think you get four or five in each pack. They also had these indoor garden galvanized signs. I love these. This one says garden. It's got like a gardening glove. It's got a watering can at the top. Hello has the flowers and the bird at the top there. Then the welcome has a shovel and a butterfly. They've got their mini rakes that you can attach to the poles that they sell. These also attach to the poles. They've got the um, garden tiller and the garden shovels. They're starting to put out their trellis and their um, flower pots. They also had these new signs, which were so cute. It says, welcome, bloom, and garden. You've got the bloom has the ladybug. And then the garden has the snail. There's a close-up. And then the welcome one has the bumblebee at the top. They also had these picket fence signs. The flowers are in a little bit 3D kind of form, a few of them, and they have the galvanized metal accents. And there are two different ones. They have the spread your wings and fly over in the garden section. Listen to birds and relax. And home is the nicest place. We also have um, so many weeds so little time. And this is the home is the nicest place to be. Also, our family is blessed like branches of a tree. We may grow different directions, um, but roots remain as one. Now for toys, games, and entertainment, they've got the small um, stuffed characters. You've got the Batman. There are two different Batmans that you can purchase. Uh, there is the um, sand that you can remodel over and over again. It doesn't dry out. Also, the shape and decorate clay world. You've got the animals and dinosaurs. We've got these light up wands. They already come with the batteries. It takes three button cell batteries, but those are already in them. You get purple or pink. Now for the Dollar Tree Plus items. We've got these large bears for Valentine's Day. They're $5 each. The gnomes, the large ones here are $5. The smaller ones are three. There are these Valentine's uh, Day potted plants. So pretty. These are $5. They either come in pink or red. The $5 um, wooden heart signs, they come in red and white. The flower rose wreaths, these are $5 in pink and in red. And then we've got the light up uh, 12 count heart string lights, those are $5. They have a few different red ones, they also have pink, some look like they're in glitter. And then they have the larger plastic that's kind of like all glued together style. We've got the table runners for $3. They're 12 by 72 inches. You can get the solid red. It has like the stitching around the hearts there. And then they have the red, white, and pink. And it's the same size. And those are all $3. There's these large stuffed animals that have a heart on the side, they are $5. It also has a tag that says to and from, so you can address it like a card. This one here is like a dragon or a dinosaur. He's kind of got like a tie-dye look to him. He's like blue, yellow, and green. They also have a unicorn, he's purple, pink, and white. And then this little bear here is blue, purple, and white. Some large flower pots, $5. They have these stepping stones you can paint yourself. Comes with the paints. They are $3. We've got the dinosaur, a unicorn, and um, I believe it's a clownfish. 
There's also these large pots for $5, the solar lanterns. And then a few Easter items. They have this Easter greeting sign. These are really large. Um, they're every bit of about 20 inches tall. And they are about a half inch thick. And they are only $3. There are two of them. You can get the every um, bunny welcome or Easter greetings. For $5, they have the window hanging plaque. And um, these are really pretty. You can get them in white, natural wood, or blue. And they have a wreath on the front. Some say like Easter blessings. One has a wood cut out bunny. So they're all three of them are different. We also have the six foot hanging Easter garland that looks like Easter eggs with the beads. And then the large um, Easter bunnies that stand, they are $5 each. And that's all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. And thank you guys for being patient. I'm feeling much better. So hopefully next week's videos will be out on time. I hope you all have a great weekend and I'll see you next time.